Hi, I'm Nick Bellissimo, and I'm an Associate Professor of Nutritional Physiology and Director of the Nutrition Discovery Labs at Ryerson University. I'm Christy Brissett, and I'm a registered dietitian with a Master's in Nutritional Sciences. I counsel clients, and I write for some of the top magazines and newspapers in North America. Do you have questions about sugars and sweeteners? You're not alone. It can be really confusing out there with all of the conflicting media coverage as well as latest research constantly changing our minds about sugars. So what we did is we took to Google and took a look at your most burning questions about sugars. And we're going to do our best to answer them for you today. We're going to start with one of your most popular questions. Is sugar bad for you? So um, sugars are found in a variety of foods, including uh, fruits and vegetables, um, or they can be added to food as an ingredient. Um, and sugars are not dissimilar to other carbohydrates in that they provide the body with energy, uh, provide fuel during exercise, and support normal brain function. But really the important takeaway message is that whether sugars are naturally occurring or added, the body handles them in the exact same way. That's right. And a healthy diet has the right number of calories for you and your physical activity level as well as enough of the vitamins, minerals, and other nutrients that your body needs. Taking in too many calories, whether it's from sugars, other carbohydrates, protein, or fat, is not a good idea. This can lead to weight gain, and we know that being overweight is linked to a variety of health problems. We hope we answered some of your top questions about sugars and made you think twice about some of the answers. And thanks again for joining us.